Hi everyone, it's Adam from WebStarts here and today I wanted to share with you a great commenting tool that I found on the web called LiveFire. Now LiveFire works great with WebStarts and what it is is it's a social commenting tool that will help engage your site visitors with anything that you've posted to your website. So what you're looking at now on my screen is my WebStarts website and I'm in my editor view where I can make changes to my page. I've got my home page selected and what I'm going to do is click over on this tab and I'm going to show you livefire.com that's L-I-V-E-F-Y-R-E dot com now if you haven't already created a livefire account that's the first step that you need to do. Now I have created an account and once you've done that just go ahead and put the URL of the uh, of your website into the field provided and then what you're going to do is click on this custom link and then click keep going and from here what you're going to do is select this code and you're going to right click and choose copy that's going to put the code onto your clipboard and then you're going to come back over here to your web starts website and choose the option to insert HTML. I'm just going to right click again and paste that in the space provided. Now what you're going to see is this live fire comments box which lets people log in with Facebook and Twitter and uh, other uh, uh, networks so that they can make a comment about your website uh, right on your web page. So I can resize this any way I want. You can see that I've logged in as a barger there and uh, you can see one person is listening, that's me, and now I'm just going to drag and drop that to wherever I want it to appear on my page. And then I'm going to save my changes, and then click over here on the preview tab, and you'll see uh, what my live page looks like. Let me refresh that there. Okay, so now you can see what my page looks like. I've got uh, my live fire comment box right on my page here I can just start typing comments and I can leave those on the page click post comments and you can see there uh, where I posted and then that populates down the page so one thing you want to do is be careful not to leave uh, anything below this comments box like here I've actually left some of this other content below it so as the comments fill in uh, this will begin to overlap so one thing you want to do is make sure you put that comments box uh, at the bottom of your page or remove you know anything that's below it so in this case I can just click on any of this and then click the red X to remove it so there you have it that's live fire working on web starts a nice little social commenting and engagement feature for your web website don't forget to visit webstarts.com to build a free website and, of course, see more helpful videos like this.